Hello, Sarah. Hello. So I am with Sarah Lessie, who is the author of... Uh, Once, Once You're Lucky, Twice You're Good. I'll okay. Take it out of you. <laughs> and uh, I have some questions for you, Sarah. Okay. So I'm going to start uh, with... Uh, so what do you think about... Uh, for companies and individuals to have all their contact information in just one single place on right. the web. Right. And uh, what's your thinking about the trends of the vanity names that uh, uh, now a lot of websites are doing, like Twitter, right. Facebook recently. So give us your, your thoughts. So I might be a little different than other people you're talking to because I'll answer the last question first. I was actually in um, Africa when the Facebook vanity URL thing happened and I was stunned it was as big of a deal as it was in Silicon Valley. I think it really largely doesn't matter. I think people who want to find you on Facebook find you on Facebook. And I don't think it really matters if I have Facebook slash Sarah Lacey or not. Um, I think it's a defensive gesture. People don't want someone else to have their name. But other than that, I think just kind of having your own URL is the most important thing. Like having SarahLacey.com is way more important than anything else. Like. As much as we've had all these other things pile on top in terms of social media, email doesn't get replaced. Basic web functionality doesn't get replaced. And so I think sometimes we get a little too excited about things and like it actually, in the grand screen, things doesn't matter that much. So vanity URL is great. I've not been on Facebook. I haven't registered mine. I heard they saved it for me, but I don't even know, frankly. I don't really So what do you care. think about uh, now that you have your saralessi.tel with all your profiles yeah. and your online presence? How do you no, like that? It's, it's great. I mean, it's like, I think if you're in any way, even in the small sphere, a public person, it's important to reserve your name, whether it's on your URL, whether it's, you know, like what you guys are doing, whether it's on MySpace, whether it's, you know, any big platform, it's important to reserve your name because someone else can take it and, you know, and do things you don't want with it. So I think it's almost more defensive than it is anything. And then obviously if something emerges into what Twitter has, into what Facebook has, then it's actually really, really useful. But I think it, it starts out defensive and then it emerges into offensive and really useful. Okay. Thank you, for, Sarah, for that interview. <laughs> and uh, have a wonderful stay in London. Thank you. In the UK and enjoy the Traveling Geeks uh, tour. I will. Thank you.